Hey guys, welcome back to Doom 2. My name is Rob, and this is the Circle of Death. It's a big, diabolical donut. I should have switched over to... Yeah, there we go. That's what I should be using. Ow! Hey, lost soul, maybe get lost. Yeah! Yeah, I better just go ahead and go around this parameter. Deal with these other guys later. So this particular level is a little bit of a relief from the last one. There's only, I don't know, let me see what that was. I know it's, it's in the double digits, I can see that. How did you get out? Do not spit lost souls everywhere, stupid pain elemental. Don't do it! Where in the, okay then. I am not doing so good here. Die already. Keikos and paid elementals and an imp over there in the corner need to deal with. Imp? Sit down somewhere. We got this jazzy tune again in this level. I absolutely love this track, but it's like so undo me. <laughs> Catchy as heck, though. Love it. That was dangerous. <laughs> yeah, Lost Soul come flying at you and it's uh, potential to blow yourself up with that. Where do they keep coming from? And somebody else is spitting venom at me. No. Keiko, sit down. Quit spitting. Bad Keiko. I need to go in there eventually, but I want to kill as many enemies in this outer donut that I can kill. I love donuts. Hmm. Some shells down here. Uh oh. I have done agitated some specters, it looks like. Where are they? Oh, they're up there. Oh, well, in that case, let me throw them a hot pepper. Cut down on some of the noise. There we go. That'll take care of that. Go there in a second. Let me make sure I didn't miss any ammo. There is. Ow! What the? Who did that? <clears throat> what the mess? Okay then. Well, Bell Knight, if you wanna, if you wanna go that route, then there we go. looking over here at that Revenant. I want to go ahead and deal with him. But I can hear what I assume to be a lost soul. I don't know where he is, though. Oh, well. Let's see here. Did I get him? I got him. All right. Slow start to the level. We're doing all right. Yellow! Some arachnotrons up here. I was calling them spider brains in one of my earlier videos. And then I realized that wasn't the right terminology for them, so... Yeah, let me correct myself. In this episode, they are arachnotrons. Maybe they're also known as spider brains, I'm not entirely sure. Imp. Uh-oh. Okay, I'm not in a good position here. Let's see. Oh, 
There's one. Spicy. Imp. Who are, you, who are you trying to impress? Get out of here. Alrighty. And then this is a secret, uh, something up here. Some armor, a chain gun. I forget what all is in this spot. But also, yeah, that opens, I thought so. What's in here, though? Anything? I think you just dropped down. Right? Yeah. Alright, got an, an invisibility sphere. Probably should have saved that, but it's alright. I'm just kind of vibing to this jazzy music. Hello, imp that I missed. There we go. Yeah, compared to the refueling base, this level's pretty relaxing until you get right up here. Bad things happen up here. Get an introduction to the final new enemy of Doom 2. I know a lot of y'all are looking forward to uh, seeing how I deal with this. These things can be very hard to fight if you don't have cover to get behind. There we go. Probably the most single most dangerous enemy in all of classic Doom. <laughs> but that actually went very smoothly. That was a pretty smooth encounter with an archvile. Because they can like hit you from anywhere with that freaking fire spell they do. Unless you like get something between you and them. For some reason then they can't track you with it or something. I don't know. But when it hits you like man it does some gnarly damage. As far as how dangerous they are, I would say they're up there with a cyber demon. Just my noobish casual opinion though. Okay, we got a blue key. I guess I should take it through the blue door. Go ahead and quick save it again here. Some shells, health, bullets. Yeah, I already killed everything that I needed to worry about here. These cells, I'm gonna hit the switch. I know I'm not offering up much commentary for this part, but I mean, I don't know, there's not a ton to say. And I'm just like, I would honestly rather hear this music than myself talk. I guess I could have done this part without commentary, but that would be weird considering every other part I've done has had commentary, so might as well keep it up. Um, what did that switch do? I forget. I'm gonna have to look around for uh, what I just opened up or did with that. But yeah, 71 enemies compared to um, freaking 261 from the refueling base. That's a uh, get lets you have a little breather in this level. Hmm. Where do I go from that switch there? Did I forget something? Somewhere else, maybe? Make sure I didn't uh, miss something here. Open that up. Hit the switch. Hmm. Don't know. Maybe uh, try going up this way. What is the game trying to lead me to? Do I go back here? Wait a minute. Oh, I bet I jump down there. Unless that might be a secret area, though. Yeah, I think it is secret. Hello? Well, either way, it's a secret I wanted to get, so we'll get it. Lots of rockets. We'll get some more cells. Oh, yeah. We're locked and loaded now. Oh, yeah. That raised up a thing where I could run out onto this middle platform here. Well, shoot. 
Hey, still got to it. That's what matters. Okay, something else opened just now. I don't know. I didn't see what it was. But anyway, gonna go towards this way. Open up the red door. Yikes. It's an ambush. Who is still trying to bite me? Get out of here. Hello, Hell Knight. Ouch. There we go. Uh, let's see. Open. I want to go in there. There's an invulnerability sphere. And I want it. Such chill music. Uh, ooh, I need to get the BFG ready. There's gonna be like a crap ton of pain elementals here. Go away! Stop biting me! <laughs> totally used uh, BFG on that lost soul unnecessarily. Get! You're not wanted here! <laughs> if you've played Bloodborne, that should sound familiar to you. You're not wanted here! Foul beast! I've been kind of wanting to play Bloodborne again. That's such a good game, it merits multiple playthroughs. Could do a soul level one run of Bloodborne, that would be, uh, well, blood level four, I think. I think four is the lowest level you can go in Bloodborne. Oh, hello, Keiko. Tag, you're it. Ouch. Yeah. You hiss at me. You sound like a cat that I'm trying to give a pill to. If you're ever trying to make a cat take a pill, you know, that's... That's, that's not for the faint of heart. Cats do not like to take medicine. All right, let's get stuck on a tree for a second and then jump down here. Stupid imp digging your dirty fingernails into me. Ow, that took a lot of damage. Go away, I forgot. I forgot we had specters. No fun. That's all right. We got health. Do 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 do. I hear another imp. Don't you dare scratch me! Ah! I said, don't scratch me. Sheesh! Don't you listen? I hate the sound of these arachnatrons. They trigger me. Stop walking. There. Let's see, where does this go? Oh yeah, that's right. The game's nice to you and it's all like, here, you want a, a soul sphere? You can have it. <clears throat> There's only one item I haven't gotten. Wonder what it is. Was there armor that I might have missed? I'm gonna look, I'll quick save it here and then look around the level to see if I missed any uh, like armor or something. Well, I looked for it, but I'm pretty sure the item I missed is just a rad suit somewhere. But I did go back and get some ammo that was laying around. That's why I'm missing a little bit of health and armor. But look at my cells. I'm up to 503. And this switch here, does it not look like... It reminds me of the cover of a Megadeth album. I'm pretty sure that's what it's in reference to, but I'm not 100% sure. Somebody can let me know down in the comments, but let's go ahead and hit the switch. The Circle of Death finished with 104% kills because freaking pain elementals are a thing. Got all the secrets, but missed one item. And it took me about 15 minutes to run around the parameter like 60 times looking for that last item, but I finally gave up on that. So anyway, that's it for this episode. Next time we'll be doing the factory. 
You have won. Your victory has enabled humankind to evacuate Earth and escape the nightmare. Now you're the only human left on the face of the planet. Cannibal mutations, carnivorous aliens, and evil spirits are your only neighbors. You sit back and wait for death, content that you have saved your species. But then Earth Control beams down a message from space. Sensors have located the source of the alien invasion. If you go there, you may be able to block their entry. The alien base is in the heart of your own home city, not far from the starport. Slowly and painfully, you get up and return to the fray. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you soon with the next episode of Doom 2. Until then, y'all take care.